Today we were doing our last class of the Printing on Hand Gilded Paper course, which uh, has been an eight-week course. We're having our final class and it's a whole new experience in being able to display your artwork. The effects that you can get by putting photos on the gold. It's just really interesting, and the different kinds of goals. We got some killer student results. We get our paper, and then at that point, uh, we would use an acrylic paint. And then you put a size on it, and that's very similar to mucilage. At that point, we add uh, gold leaf. The gold is very, very light. Just having someone walk by will move a leaf off of the paper before you're ready for it to come off. Thank heavens we finally got a gold leaf that you could put on and press down with your hands, but the first one you had a little brush and there was gold leaf flying all over the place. <laughs> the first one I put on, I put on uh, just regular 22 karat gold, and today we're doing uh, 22 karat moon gold, which has got a slightly different hue then we used an inkjet receptive coating over the gold, and then we printed it on a Canon ProGraph Pro 1000 printer. I've been involved in photography for years, but I've never done anything like this. Traditionally, I started this out thinking black and white would be the way to go, but one of my students, Kathy Grosshart, printed this color flowers, and it was just stunning. I couldn't believe how beautiful the gold looked. The class was completely free. Barry got a grant from the Wyoming Arts Council. It's always great to have new thinking because you grow, and, and, and all the people that are in my class feel the same way. I don't think anybody's ever too old to learn something new. You know, wintertime in Wyoming is getting cabin fever, and this is a good cure for it. You would be amazed what you can learn and what you can do. Try it. <laughs> mm -hmm.